welcome to my channel if this is your first time here my name is nicole and i am creating my channel on nursing school content um if this is not your first time here i want to say welcome back um thank you for being patient with me i haven't had much to vlog about because i really haven't had much going on as far as school goes um i did do my orientation already so this video is going to be on my school haul and i will do my orientation video later it's not really going to be that much about vlogging it's really just going to be me talking about everything that we discussed in orientation the different things that we did um different things that you could be prepared for in orientation and whatnot and um yeah so i'm just gonna go over that briefly or whatever um whenever i get ready to post that but let's get on to this haul so first i'm going to do um the supplies that they asked us to get i'm gonna do those first and then i'm gonna do um the supplies of what i chose to get what i thought that would be good for me um as i prepare through school this is year of school whatever so without further ado let's get into the video okay you guys so as i said i'm going to do what they asked us to get first and then i'm going to do the things that i got on my own okay so first off one of the things we had to get was a stethoscope i got the litman classic three i got this um i almost started to get a cheaper version but then i was just like just go ahead and invest and go ahead and get one so that hopefully i will not have to buy now and i asked um one of my sister-in-laws who is a nurse practitioner and she recommended the litman so um yeah i decided to go ahead and get the litman um i got it in plum purple and i got this thing right here i don't know if you can see it it's a little it's backwards or whatever but anyway i got this thing off of amazon personalized or whatever um it didn't take that long to get here i'll try to link it in the description below but yeah so i got this one in the plum purple um another thing that we had to get was a blood pressure um machine i just got the basic one and i got this off amazon as well most of my materials and stuff came off amazon by the way i'll like i said i'll link them um below um this brand is the Paramed Basic Blood Pressure Cuff. And it came with a little pouch or whatever. I'm not going to pull all this stuff out. You can see the blood pressure cuff machine. Hopefully, if you're in nursing school, you've seen one of these before. So, yeah. I just want to say, if you guys see, I think in my intro video, um my daughter's yorkie her name is bailey she uh got into the camera a little bit so y'all might see her from time to time on my blogs um she's a little busy she's cute but she's bad but anyway the next thing that we had to get was the uh pulse oximeter so i got this one i think this was like maybe ten dollars on amazon i'm not sure for sure sure don't quote me on it but like i said i'm gonna link everything in the description below um the next thing we had to get were stoggles and for those of you who, have, who know these stoggles are like safety glasses but um uh, cute cuter cuter version of safety glasses so i got this pack right here it came with two i got a side uh I thought they were black, but now that I'm looking at it, it's more like a dark hunter green or whatever. And I got the other second pairs in plum purple. Um, if you haven't guessed yet, purple is my favorite color. So um, I tried to stick with a color scheme just because I'm a little extra like that. So my color scheme is purple and black. But anyway, these are my stoggles. Cute. They're cute. Yes. See, they got the little safety thing right there to protect your eyes and also on the top. Very cute. Okay, so. Don't go there. 
another thing that they required us to get was black shoes I actually have a ton of black tennis shoes, so I'm not for sure if I'm gonna buy any more. If I do, then I'll do a video whenever I get ready to do um, an update on the supplies that I actually use throughout school or whatever. But um, I got these crops just because they are um, skid free or whatever, and they are leather, so I can wipe them off, you know, or whatever. Great for like when it rain because a lot of my tennis shoes have mesh um and i'm not for sure if i want to be wearing mesh as i go through my clinicals or whatever so another thing they asked us to get was a laptop this is a dell i don't know what i got this at the pawn shop you know so i'm cheap I have another laptop, but I use that for my crafting, for my, um, for my side crafting business or whatever. And um, I'm just using um, this one. I'm just gonna use for school itself, just for school. Um, the next thing I got, we had to get blue scrubs. So um, our colors are navy blue. So I got this. This is a jacket that I got. I think I picked this up from Walmart. Um, we will have different scrubs for like our clinicals um we'll get those scrubs will be like sized or whatever but on our days that we don't have clinicals we have to actually wear um navy blue scrubs so i'm not gonna pull all of them out i'm not gonna pull my shirt and out they just navy blue scrubs um i did get the healing hands brand purple label the next thing we had to get were shields shears so yeah i think i got these like a pack or two off of amazon um like i said most of all my stuff came from amazon um the next thing we had to get was a watch with a second hand i got this in the navy blue just to uh match my um scrubs because you know purple like i said purple is my favorite color i would have preferred to have a purple one but yeah we weren't able to um they didn't want us to get any type of watch that had bling on it they preferred us to get something that we could easily wipe off which i don't think this is gonna be easy to wipe off but hey a little lifestyle spray it'll do the shit it'll do the trick um the next thing we had to do was get um tape measure i got these in a pack of four and i want to say these was maybe like six or seven dollars retractable or whatever I, I haven't played with it so I don't, I don't know how to put it back in there but anyway so another thing we had to get was a planner like I say purple is my favorite color I got this from Walmart I want to say this was like maybe 10 11 dollars um it has like the big calendar because I write big so I got the big calendar but it also has um the weekdays back broke down so i do very much plan on using this a lot it's probably going to be like my best friend okay so i think that's all that they really told us to get um that was like they told us that we absolutely had to get um so now i'm going to move on to the things that i decided to get for myself so i wanted a book bag with a lot of pockets i wanted a heavy duty book bag i wanted something that was going to last the whole year because um my program is three semesters uh fall spring and summer so i wanted to make sure that i got a book bag that was going to last all three semesters one that was waterproof one that I was not going to get dirty. And as I said, my color scheme is purple and black. So, of course, I got my book bag in black. It has a lot of packets. This is from like my water bottle or whatever. Um, it's got this big pocket, small pocket, I meant to say, in the front. that has another pocket inside of it. Let me see so y'all can see. Uh -oh, down a little too far but anyway it's got these little pockets and then it has another zipper and if y'all can see like this 
It also has a functional pocket right here on the top where I can like put my glasses. I do wear glasses like when I read or even when it's nighttime because I can't see. But anyway, and then the big the big part has um a pocket that has actually a functional zipper. This it goes all the way down. Like my whole literally my whole arm can fit in there. It's really big. Um and then it has um laptop iPad pack uh laptop the ipad um pocket i do have an ipad with a keyboard i'm not sure if i'm going to use that for school or if i'm just going to use my laptop i'm gonna just play it by ear and um see how it goes but it's also got this extra padding on the back you guys when i say this boot bag is heavy duty it is heavy duty and um it was 50 dollars on amazon but i brought several boot bags throughout um my motherhood and i always spend anywhere from 50 to 80 dollars on my daughter's book bag for a name brand book bag this is not a name brand book bag but it's heavy duty and it's actually better than some of the book bags that i brought her so the next bag i have is my gonna be my clinical bag i got it in light purple i'm pretty sure you guys if you're watching this video you have seen several nursing supply house just like me and seems like everybody has a boot bag similar to this um some people say it's like, i just don't like the shoulder bags like i don't want to be toting around anything on my shoulder i don't have the perfect back mm -hmm. like i say i'm one of the oldest students that's coming um going to school in my program that'll be in my class or whatever but i don't want to be toting anything on my shoulder i don't want this just seems more comfortable or whatever so i got this i got this off as amazon too it has two um pockets in the front deep pockets in the front it has a pocket right here that's pretty deep um and then it has another zipper right here that you can like put your pins and uh oh i don't even see this it's got like a clear little ziplock baggie you know if you want to put your pins and your markers in there so in case they bleed out they will not mess up your bag then like that's perfect um also it has a big pocket in the front with a another little small pocket it doesn't have a laptop no it doesn't have a laptop pocket or whatever but i don't plan on taking my laptop to clinicals no way um it also came with this like little charger card where you could charge your phone or whatever while you're in uh there and I also got pockets for a water bottle on both sides. And in the back, this is unique. In the back, it actually has another pocket with several with a with a like a padding for your bag. So I thought that was really cool. Um, I don't know exactly how much I paid for this, but I know it was very reasonable. Very, very reasonable. Um I don't know if I will try to get a smaller bag or if I would just like keep this bag. I'm kind of like just gonna play it by ear because I don't really know what I will be taking a clinical or whatever. But if I see that this is way too big or too much, then I would definitely get a smaller bag. Okay, so the next thing I got is my water bottle. Um, I forgot what ounce this bottle is, but I did. I got it from Walmart. I know it's the Bubba brand, brand, and I did make sure I got one that had the mouthpiece that closed inside of here because um, going to clinicals and stuff, you don't know what kind of germs floating around. So put your mouth on there. And I did personalize it myself. I'm going to like personalize a lot of my stuff because I'm extra. I like being extra. But anyway. Yeah, so that's my water bottle. And it does fit. My husband was like, it wasn't going to fit in my book bag, but it does. It does. See? Perfect. Okay, so the next thing I got. I'm sorry, y'all. Seriously. I'm still learning this whole vibe and thing, so y'all just be patient with me um, as I get all the kinks and stuff out, as I learn how to edit my videos more sufficient, as I learn to vibe more. Just be more patient. Just be patient. 
Okay, so the next thing I got is the umbrella, pink, purple, and black that I'm gonna uh, keep in my book bag. I'm gonna probably get another one for my clinical bag just because I don't wanna be taking stuff from my book bag to my clinical. You know, I wanna try to like make it as less hectic as possible or whatever. I don't wanna have to be going through my bag every single day trying to figure out if what I need to take out of my book bag to put into my clinical bag. Okay, so the next thing I have is two binders. I am um, currently, I already had this purple one or whatever, but I am currently working on actually um, personalizing these um, to my liking. Uh, yeah, so I didn't get done personalizing before I had actually did this video, but this is just the XC one. Um, I got them both in a size one and a half inch. Um, this one is just gonna have my name on the back. This one here, I know you can't see it's kind of backwards because of how my camera is, but I put on the back of here, God grant me the serenity to accept the things that I cannot change, the courage to, to change the things I can and the wisdom to know the difference. Like this is one of my favorite sayings, um, seriously, like one of my favorite sayings for real because um, sometimes we try to change things that we can't we try to change people's that people that we can't not people's we try to change people that we can't people that are not willing to change or whatever and i just want to constantly remind myself that just always do my best and always do my do what i'm supposed to do do right by um people that's around me people that i care about people that i don't care about and then you know like i say you can't help everybody so i want to be able to um be able to step that. Be able to be okay with not being able to change people or things around me. Be okay with not with um, being able to help people or ch uh, people around me. I'm getting tired, son, y'all. But you know what I mean. Like I just want to um, live in a good place, in a peaceful place, and just do right by people, regardless. You know whether or not they do right by me. I just want to be have my conscience clear and know that I did right by them. So the next thing I got is a lunch bag. Um, I've had this lunch bag for a long time. I think like beginning whenever I was trekking, I had got this lunch bag or whatever it has. Um, a zipper right there. It has a little spot down here where you can like put stuff down there, your water or whatever. And then it's got a big pocket right there. And of course it's purple. So with this, I got these. I think I got these from uh, Staples. And I wanted to make sure I got the thin ones because I wanted to have excess room and I have my lunchbox all blucky and uh, heavy or whatever. So the next thing I got is one thing that I'm pretty sure you done saw a million times if you are going to nursing school and you've been watching nursing halls just like me. I didn't um, really get the one that everyone had, which was the heart with the, you know, the heartbeat or whatever I found this one and I like this one and I'm also going to personalize it it will have my name on the bed like in purple or whatever so yeah I got that and inside I just got an extra pair of like I said I had brought this in a pack of two so I got an extra pair of shears I got a permanent marker a pen and I have two pen lights one is a yellow light one is the led because um i did hear the horror stories with the led light so i just wanted to make sure i had got both of them or whatever so yeah it's my stethoscope case the next thing i got was these pack of heavy duty sheet protectors um, I got these for like handouts for like taking my notes. If I take my notes on um, copy paper, I can just slip it down in there. I don't have to worry about no hole punching or none of that stuff. And um, these were a set of 200. And you guys, when I say these are heavy duty, like I haven't seen none in the store that's this thick. Like this is so thick. I don't know if y'all can see on this camera, but this is real, real thick. Very heavy duty. So I'm proud of myself for um, actually looking into getting these versus buying them out the store and like i said i got a count of 200 and i believe this was like 20 dollars on amazon so <clears throat> the next thing i got is loose leaf paper i have maybe like 10 packs to this i love to write i love to read um 
that's how I learned. Like reading and writing has always been my thing. I like from old school. I don't like electronic books. Um, I rather have my books in my hand. Um, yeah, and the way I learn is to constantly write stuff over and over again. Like most people can sit there and read constantly. I can read constantly because I love to read, but writing, it actually sticks with me. If I write stuff repeatedly, repeatedly yeah. This is with me. I remember when I studied for the T's test, I wrote my notes and I wrote um, study guides and stuff. I wrote that over and over and over again or whatever. So yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, the next thing I got, I got two folders for my first two classes. I'm not even sure if I'm gonna use these or whatever, but I'd rather have them than not have them. Um, the next thing I got, or headbands. I got these headbands for um, mainly for clinicals or whatever. When we have to, um, I got, and I got two different. I got two different packages, but they're really the same headbands, just different colors, just different colors and a different brand. But yeah, these are the ones with the buttons on there, so that you know how you wear a mask after so long it starts to hurt your ear. So these allow you to put the mask strings behind the buttons. So that they don't rub up against your ears. Okay. The next thing I got is these masks for clinicals. Um, I want to say I got these in purple too. Uh, I didn't want to go see. Yeah, I brought them in purple, of course. And these are the uh, KN95 masks. These I will always keep a couple of with me, you know for clinicals or whatever. Um, the next thing I got is my pen, my pen and pencil case or whatever. I can't remember where I got this from, you guys. I hope I could find out, you know, look back and see where I got it. Cause I know I got it like a while ago. I started buying school supplies even before I got in nursing school. <laughs> like I had already claimed it. You know what I'm saying? I had already claimed it or whatever. And um, God had it for me, so. Yeah, I had already started buying stuff. But anyway, this is a big pistol pouch. It's got like um, some little holders or whatever. I think, I wanna say I got this either from Shein or Timu. I don't know, I ain't paid but like a couple of dollars for it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, Mel, uh, did we call Mel Bay? I'm sorry, y'all, my husband calling me. <laughs> Uh, Kyle Milton. So the next thing I got, let him know that I'm I'm black. But anyway, the next thing I got were these little notebooks. Um, I heard that they were good to have like in your pocket or whatever when you did um clinicals. I got a huge pack off of Amazon. I still want to say like 16 of them. I have several. I have. I actually got some of these from Dollar Tree too. But I like these on Amazon because the pages actually fold this way you know so i got plenty of those i probably won't even use all these for um school which is okay you know what i'm saying like if somebody need one or whatever then i don't mind sharing if somebody forgets something and they need to um um i have extras or whatever then i don't mind like you know what i'm saying being like well you can have one of these you can have this or whatever it's no big deal because i have plenty but whatever i don't use i probably use whenever i get my first job or whatever so yeah, that's that. The next thing I got was compression socks. I got these off of Amazon as well. I got them in a size, I mean a color black, and I got them in a size large, large to extra large or whatever. So yeah, compression socks. I heard this was good. I don't know. I've never really rolled compression socks, but you know, it is what it is. If it's gonna help, I'm gonna be prepared. So the next thing I got, oh, I forgot. This should have went into the haul with the ones that they told us to get. This is just a calculator. It's just a basic, really calculator. This is the Texas um, 3XA. I use this actually for my T's test when I took my T's test and when I took my ACT test. So yeah, I wanna say this is probably like $20 and it worked for both tests. The next thing I got, I kinda got obsessed with like, okay. So, I'm gonna just do my cards first. I got these big index cards um, for like taking notes or whatever. I also got um, 
I also got some of the smaller ones, the, I think it's three by fives or something other like that. These here are five by eights, big ones, five by eights. But I do have some small ones. I just, they're probably down in the bottom of the thing, but yeah, index cards. Um, I got the, the, metal, the metal clipboard that everyone has in their house. I got the trifold so that it can fit down in my square pocket and of course it has like the little nursing cheat sheets or whatever. So yeah, I got that. Um, I brought three, four, I brought four of these notebooks. These are one subject notebooks or whatever. Um, pen and gear. Yeah, I'm going to college and I am going to be using Wildwood Road. I'm still going to be using Rival because, I, like I said, I write big and I want my stuff to look neat and presentable or whatever. I don't want my stuff to look bunched together. Um, I also got some of this color notebook paper that um that I probably will use for like my notes or whatever, just different colors. I thought this was cute and I thought it would be like maybe something that I would use um, to take my notes with. Um, yeah, so... I also found this uh, pen clip that I'm gonna use for planicles. It's uh, the pen that has like the multiple colors on it and then it has a highlighter and it has a permanent marker. So yeah, I'm gonna use that um, on my badge rail whenever I get ready to do my clinical. I keep looking at the wrong end of the camera, you guys. So I'm not cross at it. So if it look like I'm cross at it, I'm sorry. I just keep looking at the wrong lens. But anyway, so yeah. Um, also, like this, I got a few of these notebook pads too, just to write, like jot, jot down quick stuff. I probably won't take these to clinicals because they're really too big. They won't really fit in my scrub pocket. So I'm probably not going to take those to clinicals. Um, the next thing I got is this huge pack of post-its. I heard these was good for taking notes. I got them in the pastel color. And I want to say, this was actually probably cheaper than Walmart because I think I paid $20 for this whole big pad and it's got like 24 pads in it. 24 pads. Yeah. So, I also got these little small post-its or whatever. And then I have my wireless mouse in my pad that I'll be putting in my book bag for, um, for class. I got this pill book. Um, I want to get a smaller book. A smaller book. I had actually just saw this probably like at the beginning when I first applied for nursing school or whatever. I'm not sure how much I'll use this or whatever, but I think it's a good thing to have. And I'm sorry, everything looked backwards. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out how to like turn my camera or whatever. So you guys, like I said, just be patient with me as I, um, try to learn like what works and what doesn't work but yeah i thought this might be a good reference book um first aid kit i got this from shein i'm gonna put like my um tylenol and you know um acid reflex pills and all that kind of good stuff just to have in my book bag for emergencies or whatever i don't want to be like you know what I'm saying, not paying attention in class because my head hurts or because I'm not feeling good. I could just take my own little medicine or whatever and get it popping. So highlighters, I actually have several um, highlighters. I'm gonna sit and show you. Oh yeah, and these are these are other little books that I've got. I think I found these in Dollar Tree. These are the ones that follow upwards. So yeah, I got those. Um, these are the ones that follow upwards. So yeah, I got those. Um, so highlighters. I got both of these packs of highlighters in the pastel colors. Uh, I think I might have got this one from Amazon and this one from Walmart. Either way it goes, I don't think they was over five dollars. Sorry, y'all. We in the middle of a storm and it's like our lights trying to go out. So hopefully I can finish this video real quick. It's long. But anyway, so then I got these eraser pens. My sister said that these were good to have. Um, they write in color or whatever, and you they, you can erase them. 
and then i don't plan on writing with pencils that much but i thought it'd be good to have a pack of pencils so i got these mechanical pencils right here um i also got some extra erasers um i got some post-it tabs for like dividing my pages and stuff i also got me a 32 gigabyte um usb drive to save my work tool i got this big pack of white out i'm trying to speed up before the lights go out but i got this big pack of white out um tape pens i went crazy on pens because like i said i love to write so i have these the big gelocity got those um, I also heard that these were good writing pens. I, I love me a good writing pen. These are the G2 and I got them in black. I also got these Ink Joy gels. They don't smear nothing like that. So I, yeah, I got these. They write the colors that's in there. Um, I also got this big pack of pens from um, Sam's. These are the G2, but these are the color the color ones and it says longest writing which is gonna be good because like I said I love to write I love to write I also got these flare pens um I think I got these from Sam's Club too I might if not I got them from Walmart and these I got on Amazon they were under a coupon code or whatever and it was like a uh it has the flare uh, felt tip and the ink joy it has 10 of the ink joy and 18 of the flare so yeah i think this one made 13 or 14 dollars which was a great steal i keep looking at the wrong lens y'all but a great steal for these pens i also got these the bright g2 pens gel pens or whatever i got this and i also got lastly i got these um color burst sharpie extra i mean uh ultra fine i'm sorry i got these and um i also got this that i'm just gonna light have hygiene stuff in whatever light hygiene stuff or whatever you know and then lastly i have this book right here i heard that this was good for um whenever you take pharmacology i have um i don't think i take pharmacology into my second semester or whatever but i thought this might be good to help me study it has like you can put the drug name uh generic name therapeutic use the dosage um it has mechanism of action uh adverse reaction side effects precautions the route uh, nursing intervention, high alert, patient teaching, and then it has a little section where you can do your notes. And I think this is like a 200 page notebook or whatever. I thought this would be really great to have to like study or whatever. But um, other than that, um, that is in my haul. So I'm gonna bring this video to an end. I'm sorry that it was so long. I'm sorry that, um, my lightness off a little bit and like i said um i'm still learning like where to look at in my lens and whatnot um it's storming so i'm gonna go ahead and end this video and i'll see you guys next on my orientation video again if you you haven't uh yet subscribed go ahead and hit that subscribe button like comment tell me you know what would you guys like to um see in future videos so bye